Hey, global warming is going to be much more severe than you think. And here's reason number four. Yeah? Four, 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 four. Oh, oh. So, reason number four. So, the problem is when we are emitting CO2 in the air, you know, and then people are like talking about how we are going to limit climate change to something like well below two degrees. That's like a target people were talking about. Yeah? So, or a 1.5 degree target or something like this. These things, as the other videos explained, are already unrealistic. But like, let's say, let's take the two degrees. If, you know, the global warming would be actually two degrees in the year 2100, it's not going to stop in the year 2100. Even if we wouldn't be emitting any CO2, which is also a very unlikely scenario, yeah? Even, you know, just assuming that there's a certain amount of CO2 in the air, which is going to stay in the air, then the warming is going on for hundreds of years. So something what we are doing right now is going to force global warming up for hundreds of years. So it's like in the year 2500, it's even then the rise is not complete. That's why global warming is going to be much worse. Everything what we do right now, the CO2 we put in the air today and in the decades to come, is going to have an effect on the whole planet for hundreds of years to come. It's not going to stop in the year 2100. The year 2100 was just chosen as a value that we have like models where people can calculate and then we are talking about some figures with a precise date. But it's going on even after the year 2100. The warming is going up and it can nearly double again. Even if we wouldn't do anything anymore, it could double again in some hundred years. So global warming is going to be much more extreme than you think. Thank you very much for watching. Please follow the channel.